In this video lecture, we will learn how to identify the ECG changes in cardiac tamponade. Let's first look at a question asked on cardiac tamponade in NEAT PG. So, this was the actual question which was asked. A patient suffers from shortness of breath, weakness, lightheadedness, and cough 24 hours after a heart surgery. ECG shows the following feature. What can be the most probable diagnosis? So, there is a history that there was a cardiac surgery and after 24 hours after the cardiac surgery, the person is having these symptoms. So, even, you know, uh, based on the, uh, just the history, you can, you know, uh, see that one of the most probable answer would be cardiac tamponet. But let's have a look at the ECG. We we'll first look at the rhythm strip. So, PQRS, PQRS and the rate 1, 2, 3. So the rate is around 4 by 300, around 75, 70 to 75. But one strange thing which you see is, if you see this lead, rhythm strip, this QRS, this QRS, this QRS, the height or the voltage of the QRS is actually alternating. So it's high, again low, within the same lead. There can be, you know, electrical activity difference between two leads so one lead may show a higher activity one lead may show a lower activity but within the same lead all the recording should be similar but in this case if you see the one recording is high one is low one is high one is low one is high and this can be seen throughout this is what is called as electrical alterance and which is one of the very clear signs on ecg of cardiac tamponade so the correct answer would be cardiac tamponade. Let's look further and understand this particular ECG change. Now cardiac tamponade, the changes in ECG is basically low voltage uh, QRS because the heart swings backward and forward within a large fluid filled pericardium. What we have is a normally conducted QRX complex alternating in height, which is also called as electrical alterance. So this is electrical alterance how it is seen on ECG and uh, let's look at another question. There was two questions which was actually asked on cardiac tamponade. The another variation of the question was a patient suffers so similar history of shortness of breath, weakness, lightheadedness and 24 cough after 24 hours. ECG shows the following feature. What is the treatment of choice? So again, if you see there is an alternating high and low voltage electrical alterance in the same lead. So any lead you pick this particular feature and why it is because the myocardium is moving in a fluid filled sac, in a huge fluid filled sac. 